Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today we are going to talk about how to create a KDP notebook. In this video we will demonstrate to you how to create your KDF account, how to create a KDF notebook for free, how to download it and how to upload your notebook to KDF. So watch this video till the end to better understand all these steps. First you need to visit the Kindle Direct Publishing website. You can create self-published ebooks and paperbacks for free with Kindle Direct Publishing and reach millions of readers on Amazon. With the help of Kindle Direct Publishing, you can get to market fast, make more money, keep control, publish in digital and print, and get started easily. To start publishing your Kindle notebook, you need to complete two processes. First is to create a Kindle account. And second is to design and create your notebook. Don't worry, we will show you all the steps required in these two processes. So let's start with the first one, which is the Kindle account. If you don't know, Kindle is a part of Amazon, so you can use your existing Amazon account to sign in to Kindle. So click on the sign in button here. This is the Kindle sign in page. Here enter your Amazon registered email ID or mobile number, and then here enter your password. And finally click on the sign in button. But if you don't have an Amazon account you need to create one. To do so click on the create your KDP account button. This is the KDP sign up page. Here enter your first and last name. Then here enter your email ID. Then create a password and confirm it here. And finally click on the create your KDP account button. Now here enter the OTP sent to your email address and then click on the verify button. After successfully registering your KDP account, you need to accept the Kindle Direct Publishing terms and conditions. You can scroll down to read the entire terms and conditions or else simply click on the agree button to accept it. After accepting the terms and conditions, you will be taken to the KDP dashboard. So now our KDP account is complete, let's move on to publishing our notebook on KDP. To do so, click on the Create button. On this page, you need to enter all the details about the notebook. On Kindle, you can publish your notebook by filling these forms in three simple steps. First is the Kindle ebook details in which you have to enter a title, description, the other details, publishing rights, keywords and categories. Second is Kindle ebook content in which you have to upload the cover page and the internal content. And the last is the Kindle ebook pricing in which you have to set the price for your notebook. These three steps are pretty simple that you can easily fill out. Now our second requirement is to create a cover page and internal page for our notebook. But before that we need to know what should the notebook's resolutions and dimensions be. On the dashboard page, click on the tools and resources text. On this page, under the contents section, click on the paperback file setup calculator text and you will be taken to the file setup calculator section. To get measurements of your paperback's interior, you can use the file setup calculator and download it by clicking this download calculator button. This tool gives you the margin, bleed and spine measurements. For cover measurements of your paperback or hardcover, by clicking here, you can use the cover calculator and template generator. On this page, you can find out the exact dimensions of your cover by using this calculator. You can also download a template in PDF and PNG formats to be used as a guide layer in your image editing software. Now we need to enter our notebook's information. Select the binding type from this drop down menu. You can select between hardcover and paperback, but for notebook we are selecting paperback. Now select the interior type. You can select between black and white, premium color and standard color. We are selecting premium color. Now select the paper type. We only have one option here which is white paper. Next is the page turn direction. You can select between left to right and right to left. Next is the measurement units. You can select between inches and millimeters. Next is the interior trim size. 
In the drop down, you can see there are many resolutions that you can select. And if your desired resolution is not in the list, you can use the custom print size option. Here we are selecting 7 to 10 inches. And the last is the page count. Here, enter the number of pages of your notebook. And finally, click on the Calculate Dimensions button. Now you will see a complete description about all the dimensions with the image. It is better to download this as a template. To get it, click on the Download Template button and your template will start downloading. Now that we have got a template for our notebook's dimensions, we need to create it. There are many platforms on the internet from where you can create your notebook by using this template, but we recommend you to use Canva because it has many free design elements that you can use for your notebook. After logging into Canva, click on the Create a Design button on the top right side. And at the bottom over here, click on the Custom Size button. Now change the unit to inch from the drop down and here enter the full cover dimensions of the notebook and then click on the Create New Design button and you will then be taken to the Design Editing page. Here on the left side bar, click on the Upload tab and then click on the Upload Files button to upload the downloaded template. And after uploading it, you will see it appear over here. Now click on the template and it will be added to the design. Now drag it from the corners and scale it to fit the size of the canvas. Next, let's design the cover page. Design is an art. Everyone has their own creativity, so we recommend you to use your own creativity to design your cover page. Here we are going to demonstrate only the steps needed to create the notebook. Click on the Elements tab. We are going to search for Background. In the search results, try to find a suitable one and then click on it and scale it to fit the design. Now go to the Text tab and select any text presets. Double click on the text and type something for the cover page. If needed, adjust its size, color and alignment. Now duplicate this page and delete the title. Now we need to create lines on this page to write notes. For this, go to the Elements tab and search for lines. Click on any of them as per your preferences and it will be added to the canvas. Now move it to the corner and extend it to the free space. Duplicate this line and move it below the first one. Repeat these steps to fill the entire page with lines. This is the area where users can write their notes. Now you have to just duplicate this page and make as many pages as you want in your notebook. And once you're done with designing your notebook, click on the share button on the top right side and then click on download. Now select the file type as PDF standard and here make sure you have selected all the pages and then click on the download button. Your notebook will start downloading. Now come to your KDP dashboard and you can upload your notebook here. With this, we have completed a tutorial on how to create a KDP notebook. This brings this video to an end. We truly hope you liked it. If you have any suggestions or want us to make a video on any specific topic, feel free to comment them below. We will see you soon in our next video. Till then, stay tuned and stay subscribed to our channel.